Uh, this is one of my favorite demonstrations on the dangers of uh, working on an MRI or around it. Um, this is a 1.5 Tesla superconducting magnet, which means that uh, the uh, windings are immersed in liquid helium. And we use an external power supply to feed in current, approximately 500 amps in this bad boy, and then close the special switch to disconnect the supply. Now, as long as the windings, the wire, is submerged in liquid helium and kept cold, that 500 amps is trapped in there forever. As you can see, I have some tools laying on the table. These are non-magnetic tools. Field's already pulling the scissors. And inside the bore, magnetic field pulling on the camera. No effect. Okay, over here I have a normal pair of scissors, household pair of scissors. Let me get it pointed the right way. God damn it. Okay. There you can see. Scissors are attracted by the magnetic field. Pull them pretty good. And all I'm going to do is let go of this piece of tape that's holding the scissors. And there you go. So you can imagine the danger if a patient was inside the bore, a nurse or a doctor walks in here with a pair of scissors or something else magnetic in their hand. Wouldn't be nice. And a large object like a... Uh, Oxygen cylinder cannot be held back. I yeah, brought the box out and those are the pair of scissors embedded in the box full of crap. Okay, more fun with MRI magnetic fields. Low in the place, non-magnetic. I don't know if yeah, that's not magnetic either. Anyhow, basic power generation. Move a conductor through a magnetic field and it produces a current in that conductor. As you can see, it feels like I'm moving it through water. What's happening is I'm moving the conductor through the magnetic field, it's producing any currents. And those Inside this plate, those currents produce a magnetic field opposite to this field, so that is why there is resistance. It just feels like you're moving it through thick water or something, or mud. But this is really cool. Thicker the object, more the current. It is falling. The eddy currents are creating a magnetic field opposing this field, but eventually gravity will win. And just to show you nothing special up my sleeve, away from the magnetic field, long.